We are FedNet. The year is 3037, and we are now in control. This is a simulation run to provide test data for the Starfighter project, a part of the FedNet Ultimate Expansion Program. All tactical and operational aspects of your performance in the combat zones will be monitored for future analysis and development purposes, spearheading the drive for the next generation of defensive and assault craft. It is an awesomely powerful defensive craft and tactical control center. Fitted with three high-energy laser cannons and a battery of air-to-air -air missiles, it is capable of carrying up to eight tactical fighters over long distance. Predator Mark IV, a hybrid planetary assault vehicle. Checking stabilizers, initiating ignition sequence, tracking lock engaged, all systems functioning, ready to launch. With two hyperdrive thrusters with built-in gyroscopic stabilizers, it gives excellent handling at high and low altitudes over a range of operational speed. Onboard energy processors allow for the in-flight reconfiguration of many of the ship's characteristics, including engine and laser power, which gives the ship the ability to adapt to its local environment. Project Starfighter will launch in T minus five, four. Good luck, pilot. Tracking lock off. I'm in free flight, handling better than last time. Looks like I'm gonna need backup. Run launch sequence, Hazel 5, Callum 3, and Jake 9. Watch sequence. 
sequence. Hazel, five. Talon, three. Jake, nine. Attack team will launch in T minus five, four, three, two, one. Launch successful. Radar lock detected. Six seconds till enemy craft achieve weapons range. Tracking multiple incoming targets. Formation lock. Okay. Engage all weapon systems and accelerate to maximum velocity. We're going in. Rookies, start here. Welcome to FedNet Total Immersion Systems. Simulation Program 3. Project Starfighter. Classification UEP. Welcome, pilot, to the first of many testing simulations. For these simulations, you have been allocated a Predator Mark IV in training colors. Please keep it in good condition. Aim and objectives. One, flight control. Two, safe docking procedure. Three, use of tactical map. You are free to fly around the map without simulated attack. To complete your mission, dock with the FedNet mothership.
Congratulations, pilot, on successfully completing your mission. Aerial Strike Training, Pilot Induction, Training Session 1, Part 1. Aim and Objectives. 1. Flight Control. 2. Ground Target Location. 3. Ground Target Elimination. Locate and destroy three enemy targets at grid location E7. Enemy fighter simulation is off. All simulated defenses are light. Formation locked. Okay. Engage all weapon systems and accelerate to maximum velocity. We're going in.
Congratulations, pilot, on successfully completing your mission.